All right, guys, I'm super pumped up today. We're gonna unravel everything you need to know about the east side of town, which is area, uh, the zip code is 93306. A lot of people are not familiar with it, but everything gets very exciting at Morning Drive. So I'm gonna take you on places to shop, places to live, places to enjoy and have fun with the family. And today I have a special guest, so let's get started. All right, guys, I'm Charles Payton. Welcome to my YouTube channel where family, food, and fun come together. And today I have a special guest and it is Skate. All right, I'm super pumped about showing you the east side of Bakersfield. So let's get started. Skate agent, super excited to unravel everything in the northeast side of town. He's gonna be going in places and showing you exactly what you can eat, what you can do. And I wanna be at the car level it kind of basically weaving through town to show you exactly what skate agent has in store for you. So let's get started. All right, so you know you're approaching the east side when you start coming down this hill and you have these breathtaking views. A lot of people in Bakersfield don't explore on the side of town. They don't realize how amazing the northeast side of town is, 93206. But I'm gonna unravel everything on the side of town so you can get a glimpse of exactly the lifestyle, places you shop, things that you do on this side of town. And Skate Agent's gonna be on the ground level to show you all the places right in touch with exactly what's happening in this side of town. So let's get started. All right, skate agent. So looks like you're gonna just show us sports complex at Mason Marin. Uh, so what do they have here? All right, let's go. All right, we're here at Sports Complex at Mesa Marin. This place has everything for the family. Right here, you got a splash pad. You got uh, public restrooms, a dog park, the baseball diamonds back here, volleyball, pickleball. Let's see here, I'm gonna miss something. Basketball courts, tons of greenery for you to uh, play with the kids. And then they have covered patios for you to enjoy uh, family outing. So uh, this place is pretty unbelievable. Next stop. Here we are at the basketball court and the pickleball court. So let's go take a look at the pickleball. All right, pickleball courts, here we are. So there is one pickleball court here. So uh, it's slim pickings, but at least there's a pickleball court on the east side of town. All right, next stop. All right, skate agent, so you're at City in the Hills. Uh, you hear a lot about City in the Hills, but I want you to show us what's cool and why would a family or a person move to City in the Hills? So I look forward to having you show us the ins and outs of this neighborhood, so let's get started. All right, here's a pro of living in the east side of town. You got the park here it's called city in the hills park it's a city park so you can come out here there's basketball there's tennis there's an outdoor gym outside uh, there's covered patios there's barbecues there's a volleyball court so this is really cool um, but this is definitely a pro All right, this is a cool little spot for the kids, two to five years old. They can come out here, explore dinosaur bones, dinosaur eggs. So this is really cool. And it's got a covered patio, so you don't have to worry about the sun on the kids. All right, let's check out the next pro. So you probably want to know what it would cost to get into City in the Hills. Well, there's various prices out here. Um, you can get in here as low as five hundred thousand, uh, but they do start picking up as the square footage goes up to about six hundred thousand. So, not a bad price uh, for what you get here in City in the Hills. I think that it's a good uh, neighborhood to really, uh, you know, raise a family and so forth. So, but uh, we're going to go to Rio Bravo next. So let's go. All right. So we talked about some of the pros. Now we're going to talk about the con. One of the cons that I always hear pop up is 
This is so far from Costco. And you know, I laugh about it because Costco is only about 18 minutes away from sitting the hill. So uh, for me, it's not that big of a deal, but for a lot of people, that's what comes up very often. So that would be a con. A con that I have to bring up is people always say, the mall is so far. So it's about 20 minutes from the east side of town. But for me, that's not a big deal because I'm used to driving in LA where traffic could be anywhere between an hour and two hours. So that would be a con as you're a little ways from Valley Plaza. All right, skate agent, that was pretty awesome. City in the Hills, wow, I did not know there were so many cool things here. So, uh, but I look forward to the next spot you get to show. All right, skate agent, Rio Bravo. I can't wait for you to show us and showcase everything at Rio Bravo. A lot of people, you know, they talk about Rio Bravo, but they never go out here and explore. So uh, let's go inside and uh, see what you can show us why uh, it's one of the top golf courses in all of Bakersfield. So let's go. All right, skate agent, I know you snuck into Rio Bravo. We're gonna get in here and uh, see what you're looking at. And when you pull up to Rio Bravo and you're, you're not a member, all you gotta do is pull up to the gate and let them know you're gonna have lunch or dinner and the food here is pretty amazing so uh, let's grab food while we're here all right so we made it to Rio Bravo Country Club however skate agent decided to take off he's already highlighted a few spots here but he's on to the next stop but we're gonna have lunch so you can see what the food is like here at Rio Bravo Country Club skate agent I always feature a house that I love going through this neighborhood what is your favorite house? Tell us what your house. All right, sorry I had to leave so quick and leave you hanging for lunch, but hopefully you enjoyed lunch, but you asked me what my favorite home in Rio Bravo is, and it is this kind of like a, an Adobe Spanish style home. But this is my favorite home, hopefully you like it. All right, let's get going, I got a lot to do, so let's go. All right, skate agent, so I heard there's two 55 and over community. So uh, are you gonna show us those? Hey, that's a great question. Um, I'm actually not gonna be touring Solara by Del Webb today. Um, I'm in the process of doing a video of this neighborhood, but if you're wanting to look at something that's 55 and over, uh, I have the Four Seasons 55 and over tour. Uh, so you can look at that as well. I'll click it right, I'll put it right here in the um, comment section, but uh, this one's coming soon. And let's say if you're under 55 and you don't want to be in a 55 and over community, I have Vista Monterrey, I have Rio Bravo, I have Tuscany, I have City in the Hills. Um, so if these two neighborhoods don't work for you because you're, you know, you don't want to be in a 55 and over, you can definitely check out the other videos. So uh, they'll be in my um, comment section. So you can just click those, check, take a look at those videos, and hopefully one of those videos suits you. All right, I'm on to the next stop. Man, skate agent, so I would have to tell you the views of this neighborhood are unbelievable. So I think you're capturing a lot of stuff for the people to see where, you know, they don't realize Bakersfield has these million dollar views on the east side of town. So this is quite cool, but I'm excited to see the next place you wanna show us so that we can see what we would do as activities in Bakersfield. So let's go. All right, so you're probably wondering what it costs to live in Rio Bravo. Well, there's a couple layers here. You got the patio homes at the entrance of Rio Bravo. There's a rough run you between four to 500,000. Their patio homes are gonna be low maintenance, so they're not gonna be uh, you know, a lot to take care of. And as you get cl uh, closer up on the view home, so like in the middle layer by the lower part of the golf course, you're looking at about five to 600,000. And as you get higher and higher and those views get a little more magnificent, you're looking at 1.2 to, you know, almost $2 million. But you're looking at about five to 6,000 square foot home. So that's what you get for the money. And uh, I'll see you at the next time. Man, skate agent, this drive on Alfred Highway is pretty amazing to get the calm zoo. You get to see all the mountains. You get to see uh, cows in the distance. That's quite cool. This It doesn't even feel like Bakersfield. It's just amazing. So I look forward to seeing calm zoo. It's, it's a great place for family fun. And uh, I look forward to seeing what's at this zoo. All right, skate agent, we're headed to calm zoo. So I haven't been to calm zoo in so long. So I look forward to seeing uh, what they've done, what they've changed, what they've added. So this is a, a very exciting moment and I look forward to seeing what uh, they have to offer. All right, we just pulled up the California Living Museum and uh, it's so cool that we have a museum in Kern County or Bakersfield that actually is rehabilitating animals to get them 
either rehabilitated and healthy or getting rehabilitated and getting back into the wildlife that they they're used to so uh, but you know what I'm excited skate agent let's see what uh, this place has offers so let's take a tour all right I'm super pumped about this we're at calm zoo we're gonna go inside and take a look at all the animals so you get an idea what calm has and uh, I haven't been here in a long time but I used to take the kids here it's a great thing for the kids so let's get started So we arrived at Calm Zoo and uh, we're gonna take a look at everything they have here so you get an idea of what's here. And uh, the first stop is gonna be the, uh, we're gonna look at the reptiles, so let's go. Look at this Chakawala, it wants to get out. Hey Chakawala, you gotta come by and visit the Chakawala. Come here, look at this California king snake. All right, the reptiles were cool. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that, but next stop, let's go. All right, so let's look at the mammals. So one thing I have to say, if you're a city folk and uh, th this side of town, the east side could kind of be a con for you because it's very country, so it's a pro for the people that like country. All right, let's go look at the mammals. All right, come in close. Let's look at the red fox. He's just chilling, taking a nap. All right, let's go look at the gray fox over here. We came at their nap time, it looks like. All right, more to see. There's also a petting zoo here. So the one-eared goat. All right, you definitely gotta take the kids out here. So this is a cool one right here. It's the black bear. So let's go. All right, so I can't show you everything here at the zoo. You actually have to come out to calm yourself, but this will be the last stop and then the rest of the stuff, you're gonna have to come out here yourself, take a look at calm and support them as well. So let's go to the next stop. Are you ready to see a mountain lion? Let's go, let's see. Man, that was unbelievable. I hope everyone's watching this and they get to come and support the California Living Museum because they're doing some great things in Kern County. And uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed uh, what Skate Agent had to offer as much as I did. So uh, let's come out here and support them and uh, see what we can do to help them out. All right. All right, Skate Agent, we're pulling up to Hart Park. And I have to tell you, the views just are amazing. I mean, the east side of town has views that just are so breathtaking. So um, we look forward to seeing what you uh, show us here at Hart Park. I know there's fishing and a lot of other things, but I want to see uh, what you get to show us here at the ground level. So let's go. So we're here at Hart Park. There's so many things to do here. You got the duck pond, you can do some fishing, you play frisbee golf, you can bring the family out here and have a full on barbecue. There's a ton of green greenery, so you can actually play soccer, frisbee, badminton, all that cool stuff at this park. So this is a huge pro for east siders that live on the side of town. So if you're looking to explore, relax, this is a great place to relax and enjoy and unwind. And you got the Kern River right around the corner. So if you want to just relax and read a book, you got that as well. So. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. Hart Park. Now we're gonna hit Kern River Golf Course, so let's go. All right, so another cool little thing here at Hart Park, the river, the Kern River is just right there. So if you wanna come back and unwind and relax, you got the river right here. It's got these cool little walking paths. All right, but remember, it's called the Killer Kern for a reason, so be careful when you're out here but look how cool this is. Let's go explore a little bit more. All right, skate agent, that was cool. So great place to hang out, fish, uh, but let's uh, see what the next stop has in store for us. All right. 
Dwight, state agent. Where you at? We just pulled up the Kern River Golf Course. Uh, we look forward to seeing what this place is all about. I actually have never really uh, been out this way, so I uh, would love to know what your thoughts on this golf course uh, and then also the food and so forth. So uh, let's take a dive in. Welcome to Kern River Golf Course. This is on the east side of town. It's a huge pro. Um, I recently heard that it was taken over by a new management team where the greens are phenomenal. So you guys gotta come and check it out. We're gonna take a quick little tour, but you gotta come out on the east side and check it out yourself. Let's talk about the views out here at Kern River, River Golf Course. You got views that are just amazing. All right, so one awesome thing that I have to tell you about. So if you're out here playing golf and you know, you're know you out playing golf to unwind and relax, well, there's no other place in Bakersfield that has these amazing views. The only other place would probably be Rio Bravo, but that's a private club. This one's public, but look at these amazing views. That's a quick little glimpse of the driving range. So, but look at these phenomenal views that you have out here. All right, let's go. All right, hopefully you guys enjoyed that. I had a great time here. The greens are awesome. And uh, I think you'll be quite surprised at how amazing this golf course is. So you gotta come and take a look at it. All right, next stop. Man, that was a special surprise. I loved everything about this golf course. It seems like it's really uh, wanting to uh, grow its business. It has a lot of great things happening out here. So uh, hopefully people will see this and they'll be attracted by what they have to offer. So let's go to the next stop. All right, skate agent, where are you at? We just pulled up to Lake Ming and uh, we look forward to seeing what it's all about. Let's go. All right, another pro of living on the east side is you have Lake Ming where you can fish, you can have a picnic out here, and look at these amazing views of the lake. Great spot to have a picnic, you can bring the kids, there's areas for the kids to play, but the cool part is a lot of people like to come out here and read a book and just relax. These are the type of things that East Siders do. So if you want to take a look at what East Siders do, make that drive to check out the scenery out here. But look how beautiful that is. All right, next stop. Hey, skate agent, I trust you're having fun out on your mountain bike in those hills, but I'm just gonna have to uh, sh show some clips of you out there. But hopefully you're having fun. But again, the people watching, this is another place where you can go out and ride your mountain bikes. There's miles of trails out here and uh, endless endless opportunities for you to work out on your mountain bike all right if you like this video give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you have any comments or concerns please leave them below in the comment section if you want to see stuff that happens daily in bakersfield also follow my social media channels at skate agent where i uh, showcase different places daily all right on to the next video